are gathered here tonight at this history history making moment to ensure that the hand of God is on our next Joshua will you stand to your feet as we celebrate the man of God who is going to be our new pastor and leader none other than pastor Derek Faison let's bless God in this place Oh, you couldn't be better than that. There is a Joshua. You have not been left without a witness. There is a voice. Hallelujah. Why don't you just celebrate what God is doing? The best is yet to come. He's our Joshua. This is not just another service. God right now is saying, I want to do something in this church, in this city, in this time. How many believe that, that this is our season, it's our time? God's been good to me. He's been good to me. More than this whole world could end. He's been so good. Yeah, he's been so good to me. Yeah. He wiped all of my tears away. Yeah, he turned my midnight into day. So I just say thank you, Lord. 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 I, I won't complain. Do I have any grateful people in here tonight? I said, do I have any grateful people here tonight? That said, I could complain. But God has been so good to me. I said, do I have anybody here that said I could complain? But the Lord has been good to me. Do me a favor, look at a neighbor and tell a neighbor, I don't mean to get on your nerves. I don't have time to give you my testimony. And really what I've been through ain't none of your business. But the Lord.
like he's been good. I'm just... that Mayor John Cooper, Mayor of, Metropolit of the Metropolitan Government of Nashville and Davidson County do hereby proclaim this day, April the 22nd, as Pastor Derek Faison Day. And all I want to say... And there's a song that says, Should I just can't give up now? Should I come too far from where you started from? Whoa! Should now, should now. See, sometimes the road's gonna get a little heavy. Hey, Chris, come on. But you gotta press on. Yeah, hey. Because you gotta believe. Anybody believe? Hey, yeah. That it brought me this far to leave me. Can I say? I will make the darkness light before thee. with a deep sense of Jesus' joy that we have come to install officially that that God has already done. The Lord said to Moses to set aside men that you know to be elders, that they may be elders. The truth of the matter is, we cannot make a man anything that he isn't already. It is just that when we confirm them, we identify with that which the Holy Spirit has already done. You have many wonderful people, but you haven't met your congregation yet. Your congregation is yet to be found. These are your disciples. They're going to bring in the congregation. Jesus spent more time with the 12. Yeah, that's right. Jesus spent more time with the 12 than he did the 70. More time with the 70 than he did with the 5,000. It's more than 12, but these are your 12 who got in on the ground floor and began to connect their gift with your gift, their vision with your vision. And you grow up together and the thing that God is about to birth will be unlike any other thing in the city. It is the Lord's doings and it is marvelous in our eyes. 
anoint you as the scriptures did. I smear it upon you. For everything you're worried about and for everything that's on your mind and for everything that keeps you up at night and for everything that's brought you to your knees and for everything that makes you cry out to God in the middle of the night and for everything that you cannot say and for everything and every apprehension that you might carry silently in your heart, I smear you. I smear you with oil. Every snake that tries to bite you is repelled. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. And every tongue that rises against you, God will condemn. It is so. And so it is. In the name of Jesus we pray. I need the whole church to join in and give God praise in this moment. You're not just going to pastor. Yes, sir. You're going to change the trajectory. For millions of people. That's why the devil tried to kill you. Because God marked you for destiny. And something is about to shift. Something is about to shift. If you can believe it, you can receive it. You, before this night is over, there's going to be a divine transfer. There's going to be a supernatural release. Before this night is over, you're going to break the GNP for the entire nation of Egypt. The same anointing that's on your mother and your father is on you. It is on you. The anointing of the Holy Ghost is on you. That power that God had for your life is on you. It's not optional. It's not optional. It's not optional. It's not optional. That anointing is on you. Ow! 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 That anointing. That anointing. That anointing. That anointing. That anointing is on you. That anointing is on you. Reach out and touch somebody. Tell them the anointing is on you. The anointing is on you. The anointing is on you. And everything in your life is about to shift. 